Sometimes a superstar just has that look in his eye. And this is one of those times. Folks, we are guaranteed a new champion when this one's over here tonight. WWE action on the way. Let's get it started. I'd say this team looks like they have what it takes to walk away victorious tonight. There is so much respect between these two. This is going to be one for the record books. The bell rings and Victor is in the house. The scalpel ready to slice and dice his way to victory if he can. Man, sounds like the lid is about to be blown off this place. All these tag team superstars are living in the shadow of the APA, but some of them carry themselves all right. You know, it's nights like this that keeps me coming back to the WWE for more and more and more. Once the back goes, it's nearly impossible to stand, let alone deliver any offense. What has to be going through the mind of Chad Gable right now? What does he need to do to make sure his team comes out on top here? As you know, we're talking about someone with a lot of talent. I'm not so sure I like the idea of it being showcased in a tag team. You gotta let talent like that shine on its own. What I think is gonna happen here is his team's gonna get the victory by capitalizing on a mistake made by their opponents. I mean, it could be a small thing that he detects or the equivalent of someone slipping on a banana peel. King, this Connor comes in at 268, but to me, I'd say he competes more like he's 368. Oh, yeah, he's certainly powerful, Cole. That's probably why he's so confident, too. Ow, what an elbow! Oh, man, that elbow will knock you silly. to the outside he goes where anything can happen and usually does yeah and usually happens to our announce table you better move your crown king <sighs> uh oh looks like this one's going out to the floor what was your first clue king you're right about connor's confidence but he's got to be careful with that we've seen it get him in trouble on a few occasions <laughs> knock the breath out with a crushing <laughs> kick to the gun <laughs> Dishing out some serious punishment here. That stop might have only lasted a second, but it's going to be felt tomorrow. And maybe felt for a lifetime. Six. And it's imperative he gets back in the ring right now. For me, there are a few sights better than seeing all those legends attack the Ascension on Raw a while back. 
He wants no part of the outside. And I don't blame him. Nothing good ever happens outside the ring. He's starting to stumble here. Headed into this match, he and his partner look extremely confident. And Michael, this might very well be where one of these guys pulls away from the other. Yeah, but he's got to remember that matches are won inside the ring, not outside. Connor's showing some expert prowess here. action outside the ring real dangerous out here it looks like we're gonna see what kind of pain they can inflict out here Six. on the floor he's in full-on attack Seven. mode now connor starting to stagger Eight. i don't think this is how he envisioned this match going here tonight never say never but things are not looking very good for him right now you know wins don't just happen here in the wwe Pope. jason short looked impressive tonight